my name is Wale Omiyale. I'm um, the SVP for Business Development within the Market Research Division of Confirmit. Um, Confirmit's the premier um, software solution for market research. We provide um, software for data collection, data scripting, um, reporting um, to all the market research companies globally. Um, we're number one in our field and I guess um, um, you know, an online based application so that's pretty much where we focus our, our energies towards. I think Research and Results has become much more of an international conference. Um, a lot of our clients are here so we, it's a great place to meet all of our clients in one spot. It's a great place to learn more about you know, research in one of Europe's um, premier market research economies so it's you know it's an excellent you know opportunity for us to also present and we're talking later on about you know some of the solutions we provide in, in the mobile research world so you know a great audience great um, facilities and um, you know great learning opportunity as well well today we're talking about you know um, mobile research and you know our technology and the role of our technology within mobile uh, mobile at the moment is spearheading you know, a new drive of um, products, research products, research opportunities for market research companies and so we're going to be talking about some of the successes, some of our learnings, um, some of the things we've learned along the way in developing a mobile solution for market research companies. Part of my role is working across um, Asia Pacific and Asia Pacific is one of the biggest growth areas for mobile. Um, at the moment now we're working with a number of clients across Indonesia, um, you know, 200 million people all accessing the mobile um, and mo mobile as a, as a methodology for, for, for conducting research. So, you know, markets like Indonesia, markets like Vietnam, markets like China, um, where mobile is on the increase and on the growth, those are some of the areas where we're actually starting to invest a lot more and you know, see a lot of more traction in, in, in that respect. Well, I, I think for a lot of economies, you know, mobile has been, like, I hate to, to you know, repeat myself, but mobile has been the effective way of communicating. It's, it's a mass market tool for communication, whether that be a smartphone or a feature phone. You know, pretty much everybody in the world has got a mobile device today and so for market researchers to effectively reach, you know, consumers and business leaders, you know, using mobile as a device to actually communicate with people is probably the most effective way today. Well, I think the, the good thing with Confirmit's um, solution is that from the get-go we were always a multilingual platform. Um, and in today's economy where you know, there are limited barriers um, to you know, cross-culture, cross-country um, communication, having a multilingual platform is a crucial element um, and that's part of the solution that we provide. You know, Confirmed surveys can be answered in any language, whether that's Asian characters, double bytes, Unicode enabled, you know, we're there. Um, and I think reaching consumers in the language that suits them rather than forcing a particular language onto them is probably the most effective way to get deeper insights and, 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 you know, and cross that cultural barrier that often um, occurs when you force a respondent to answer a survey or, or give you some insight in a different language to their native language. I, I think, you know, you know, reaching respondents has become increasingly expensive, increasingly difficult, um, and therefore making sure that we reach respondents in a way which is convenient to them, whether that be in their local language, whether that be in their local um, communities, whether that be in, in, in their local environment, is probably the easiest way to increase response rates. So we definitely see, you know, language as a critical or, you know, local language as a critical aspect of uh, uh, obtaining deeper insights. I think the way in which we deliver data to our clients is probably going to be one of the biggest disruptors. You know, clients are looking for single numbers, single, simple um, numbers that they can take actionable um, decisions on. And I think, you know, with the emergence of things like, you know, infographics, digital dashboards, 
the availability of, of data across the internet. You know, traditional tables, traditional charts just don't cut it anymore. And I think, you know, with the emergence of newer ways of delivering insights, especially when you think about, you know, the, the introduction of big data and the massive amounts of data that we're dealing with, simplifying that into concise, simple, easy to understand um, data sets is going to be the next big challenge for market research.